Good morning, Pastor Jerry here from Crossroads Church, Cleburne. It's Monday morning and it's time for our daily scripture reading. I'm reading back from the book of Psalms as we're finishing up Acts. All the Acts chapters are on YouTube. You can watch those videos at your convenience. And so now we're going through the book of Psalms. I'm going to read those. Uh, today we are on Psalm 3, so I invite you to pull out your Bible and open it to Psalm 3. Follow along on the screen as I read it, or simply sit back and listen as I read Psalm 3 to you. A Psalm of David, when he fled from Absalom, his son. O Lord, how many are my foes! Many are rising against me. Many are saying of my soul, There is no salvation for him in God. Selah. But you, O Lord, are a shield about me, my glory and the lifter of my head. I cried aloud to the Lord, and he answered me from his holy hill, Selah. I lay down and slept. I woke again, for the Lord sustained me. I will not be afraid of many thousands of people who have set themselves against me all around. Arise, O Lord, save me, O my God, for you strike all my enemies on the cheek. You break the teeth of the wicked. Salvation belongs to the Lord. Your blessing be on your people, Selah. Absalom was David's son, and he was actually chasing him to try to kill David. And uh, so David had to flee from Absalom. And you see his, his despair in it of his own son chasing him. But then you see who his hope is. He says, You, O Lord, are my shield, my glory, and the lifter of my head in Psalm 3. And he says, I cried aloud to the Lord, and he answered me from his holy hill. And then look what he did. He says, I lay down and slept. I woke again, for the Lord sustained me. I will not be afraid of many thousands of people who have set themselves against me all around. What a great way to look at life. What a great way to go through life is to, even though we face trials and tribulations and we face troubles in our lives, that we can rely upon the Lord, that when we lay down, we can rest in him because he has everything in his hands. He has you in his hands. He loves you. He cares for you. And he's watching over you. And he has such great plans for your life. And so you can rest assured that everything will be okay, even when life looks bleakest. You may be afraid of the, the coronavirus that's going around now, of the riots that are going on, of where the world is right now. But don't be afraid. Put your rest and your faith and your hope in the Lord, and you'll be okay. I pray that you have a blessed day, that you have a good and godly day. I love you, and I will be praying for you until we're together again. May God bless you and keep you.